and hello. We're live on an impromptu mining session, building session, something session with her AS. She got off work early, so, uh, welcome to the stream. Yay! <laughs> okay, so we're going to the Dark Fortress. Yes, you said something about we need resources for your build? Yes. I need stuffs. And to not fly into my building. Yeah, that's usually, you know, recommend to not fly into your building. Working on it. <laughs> Alright, as soon as, uh, as soon as I finish sleeping. Because apparently I, I can't seem to start at the right time of day. I like all our boxes of stuff. They look very cool from my building. <laughs> now, since I know I'm going to be working with you, let me t get rid of the stuff that uh, I had in my inventory for my own project. Because I have a funny feeling I'm going to need space. Maybe. A lot. Up, up and away! Hello. Okay. Hello. Okay. All right. So, um, besides turning literally a hundred thousand billion gazillion pieces of terracotta, mm -hmm. I need enough of this color concrete to oops to fall. Fall. Um. Okay. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um. It's going to be the thing that ties each of my tiers together, kind of like on a cake. Okay. So this room is going to go up into a tower, the one that I fell into. And it's going to make a vertical tower like in a castle. The next floor is going to be the black concrete. Okay. And... Then this one is going to be a blank space. And then this one is going to be the red concrete. And then this one over here is going to be blank. And then this fifth section over here is going to be another black tower. And then on top of each of those towers are going to be more of these gray concrete pillars that tie it in together. And there will be another floor and that floor will be in the pretty terracotta. Ooh, I heard an awful lot of concrete in my future. Yeah, so we need that. So, <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, hmm. And as far as resources I have left over, I have... Yeah. We're also probably going to need extra sand because I think I want to do some, like, black and gray stained glass in here somehow. I just don't know how yet. Okay. Alright, I've got a fair amount of sand already. Um, why do you have random heads in your concrete box? Like, should I be should worried? You guys keep throwing them at me. No, you guys keep randomly throwing them at me and putting them in my house. All right, you got a fair amount of... Except the dragon head. I like that one. Yeah. Oh, who doesn't love the dragon head? All right. Uh... You said you want what kind of glass? Um, I th think it is... Oh, I think it's on the ground out there. 
what over by the uh, that's not the one I'm looking for um, Hold on. over by our through all the mini blocks by the stuff by the stuff yeah one day I will finish a complete sentence and a complete <laughs> thought We'll just call it the stuff, because then every time we go over there, we can say, Behold, my stuff. <laughs> Alright, so we got fancy stone that you're not using. It's Let's... a special type of colored glass, but I can't find the colored glass that I want. It's one of the grays. I don't remember which gray it is. All right. Over here in the community project box under my that I'm looking into right now, we've got a stack and a bit of glass panes. We got a stack and a quarter of glass. A, singular, gray stained glass. Seven light gray stained glasses. Glasses. Glass. And seven white stained glass. So I imagine this was what you're trying to figure out. It's one of those. Probably. Hold on, I'm putting my stuff up and then I'll come down there. But I'm bringing my box in with me. Yeah, I checked the memory usage on the server when I uh, went to reboot before we jumped on. And we're hardly using any of the memory allocated, so I'm pretty sure um, the problem is that laptop is old or it's because it's a laptop. One of those two. Okay. Are those problems we can cure? At some point, yes. Yeah, so this is the gray one that had the... Gray stained glass. Not the light gray, but the gray? No, gray. Gray. Okay. Huh. And how much of the gray glass do you need? I have no clue because that wasn't part of the permanent plans. It's one of those I'm sure I'm going to find a way to put this in here somehow. Okay. Alright, let me uh, craft up a few stacks of gray glass. Now the fun question. What combination is it to make gray dye? Because I know bones are used for... I got lots of light gray. Oh. It is that simple. I think I know someone who keeps telling me that there's a menu for that. Yeah. That would also be where the that same person found it. Hypothetically speaking. Hypoth Hypothetically, yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, we'll start with that. And you don't want black, just gray. I haven't seen the black. Not in this texture pack. But I don't think so, just because I feel like I've got enough black with the black concrete. Okay. Well, because I had two stacks of black glass already up, but I will re-dye it to gray, if you would rather the gray. Yeah, no, I think the gray is going to look better. 
the gray on my texture pack looks amazing. Gotcha. like an odd number. I like odd numbers. Yeah, you, you are odd that way. Like it. And then I do, you saw, have a, quite a bit of gray concrete. I can't, don't know if that up there is light gray or regular gray. I th think it's light gray. If you press F3, it'll bring up a menu that will give you some information. You can point your cursor at the uh, block and it'll tell you what kind it is. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, should be in the lower right hand corner. <laughs> Never mind. I didn't want to fly anyway. Do you have a particular box you want this uh, gray glass in? How much is it? Uh, a bunch of stacks. How many stacks? Oh, there we go. I fit it in the one with the uh, gray concrete. It's in your blue box. Oh, that's a bunch of stacks. Mm -hmm. I'm going to need boxing. Hold on. Ooh, look at all Why are you things. setting up the shulkers like here things. if uh, we're going to be doing all the work up there? I'm sorting them. Okay. the regular gray concrete and black concrete. And you said you've already got black concrete? Ah! Lie, you fool. Um, I have one, two, three, four, five, six stacks of gray concrete, and I think it's the wrong color gray. It's gray and not light gray? Yes. Uh, ooh, yeah, that is the, uh... Huh. Is the... F3 information is telling me that that is gray concrete, but it looks an awful lot like the light gray. Maybe it's just because of the what it's sitting around. I got nothing. Gray concrete, light gray concrete. my shulkers so we have room to put all this stuff sitting. No, okay. That just looks lighter. I want to say that the concrete is one of the things that we can't recolor with the uh, mod pack that we have, or data pack rather. That's depressing. We can recolor terracotta, glass. Uh, you know what? 
I'm gonna go see anyway. Just out of curiosity. And YouTube is being really weird about the stream here. I, I've actually been thinking that I might... Uh, I might end up cutting YouTube off the list of uh, streams and just upload it after the fact when I'm done. Really? Because YouTube yeah. is weird? Because YouTube is weird. I know that's not really a surprise to many, but... Mm, not so much. I can't read lips when your lips are below the plane of my monitor. No, not yet. The poor pathetic puppy does need to be fed. Life is so hard. I know. Poor puppy. Alright, now concrete cannot be re-dyed once it has uh, been created. Super sad. Yeah, I'm not feeling all that happy about it either. Oh, that is a suddenly attentive I'm puppy. I'm missing a yellow shulker. Redye a shulker if it has stuff in it? Yes. We are going to have to go uh, squid hunting before too long. Probably. Oh, well, because you said you want more of the black glazed terracotta, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, we're. Because. Unless you got a big old stash of black ink so somewhere around. Uh, um, I'll tell you how much I have in just a second. I should probably grab that. I'm about to go make some of the uh, concrete for you. I have a box ready. I think this is the first time I've actually used the... Uh, Concrete maker. Ooh. Well, that part remains to be seen. But... Concrete maker. I'd say we need to make one of the automated ones, but if Mumbo and Green can do all the concrete that they made... Just using some random corner of a lake? Yeah, that's fair. That's really fair. This one. Oh, is that from the server glitching? Oh no, sometimes it loses them. Um, that is not acceptable. Really? It always happens to me, so I just kind of thought it was a thing. No. No, that, that's... That's not acceptable. Okay. Well, you take it up with the server. Yeah, I should definitely take it up with the server admin. That slacker. <laughs> you have fun. You argue with him. Good luck. I hear he's cranky in the morning, too. 
Mm hmm Especially without coffee. <laughs> and in the topmost tower in the middle is going to be my enchanting room, and that's where my dragon head is going. In your enchanting room? Mm -hmm. How enchanting? It's going to be enchanting. Exactly. Hi, Jeva. Are you fat and happy? For the moment. Every now and again, I think deeply of uh, getting one of those collar cameras and putting them on Java. I wonder what the world looks like from his perspective. Uh, probably like the cute. carpet under my bed. That's fair. That's very fair. Hey, while I'm making this concrete, will you go find a place to sleep? Because it's about to get unsafe over here. I'm almost there. I'm going through the temple now. Hello, puppies. I actually saw where somebody had made a data pack that added coffee to Minecraft. Wait. It's for an old yeah, it's for an older version though, so uh we wouldn't be able to get it working on the server. It would need to be updated. And uh, as much as I like it, he, I think he made it a little too overly complicated. Ah, uh, okay. There, the sleeping happened. Awesome. But, uh, I have been half tempted from time to time to undertake building a coffee data pack. Maybe setting it up as a uh, brewing recipe instead of a crafting recipe like he had. You know, because coffee. That could be cute. You know, grow some coffee, bre coffee beans, roast them in the uh, furnace. Then add them as a potion. Straight, you know, with that nothing else if you want it done right, or uh, add milk and sugar if you want extended effects. Can you dye concrete powder? Uh, that I'm not sure. I didn't try re dyeing the concrete powder. I hesi hesitate to guess no. Things possible. Getting the rest of the things that I need for my base. I have a lot of stuff. Really? I I would have never noticed. I like stuff. Stuff is a valuable thing to have. Sometimes. One should always have stuff. Also, warning, I just started watching Downton Abbey again. Oh no. <laughs> so all the British is gonna start coming back. Are you gonna go into the Minecraft settings and change it from US English to British English? That way. I actually think I have the Shakespeare one on our date right now. The the Shakespeare one or the uh, British English? I can't remember. What do I look at to tell? Uh, uh, options, language, 
and yeah I also love that there's English Australia English Canada English UK English New Zealand and English US well, to be and fair, then Shakespearean English I forget what website I was on recently but they actually had uh, English Irish but uh, I maybe okay have you ever talked to an Irish person yes she very much wanted it's to make sure thing. that her flute was ready for her trip oh I remember that lady yeah. she was awesome she was awesome Just join. Welcome to Making Concrete for Ray Est, produced by Coffeecraft. We need a lot of it. Yeah. And Terracotta, you said. Let me guess, you need more of the black. What was it? Oh, delivery. That's right. Java doesn't like delivery people. I forget how he gets about that. <laughs> he has feelings. They are mine. Well, you know, he's very protective of his castle. That is highly... That is. It's okay, buddy. No, it's not. That the person knocked on his door. I know. How traumatizing it is when a person knocks on your door. Well, oh, you know, especially when they disturb his nap. It's for serious. Kits are nearly complete. You never did say how much uh, black dye you had. Or ink socks, rather. Um, I have like 10. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna have to do some squid hunting, too. Yep. Get ready for more squid head to suddenly appear around your base. Mysteriously, I mean. Yeah, mysteriously. Mysteriously. Oh, Very strange phenomena. I have a ton of bone, though. Yeah, I got tons of bone meal, too. More than I'm sure I know what to do with. I have 63 bone blocks and 27 bone meal. So far, that I found. Oh. Oh no, that's not much at all. That's terrifying and a problem. It's not a problem. Not for me. 
It's not my fault they happen to get pushed off that cliff. I'm sure it wasn't. It wasn't. It was fated to happen. All it works like, you know, clockwork. Like a redstone clockwork. Oh, that could be a really weird That's Minecraft thing. If Minecraft. someone were to do a clockwork orange, but a clockwork redstone. We're going to say no. How about that not uh, be a thing? I almost want to search to see if somebody's already done it, but I'm terrified that somebody already has, and I really don't want to see that. Of all the people in the world, I feel like I most can say this with experience. <laughs> be careful what you search for on the internet. <laughs> yes, it's amazing what an innocuous phrase will turn up when you're looking for something like a cartoon turtle. Yes, so for everyone who's listening to this, see what happened was... I was making a gift for a friend, and she loves turtles. So I thought I would paint a mouse to look like a turtle for her. And I'd been looking up all sorts of stuff about turtles, and I thought, silly me, that the internet was intelligent enough to have seen that I was looking up all turtle stuff and know that I meant turtle stuff because it's supposed to work that way. It's supposed to be creepy like that. I mean, it knows when I pass Starbucks and don't stop there because all of a sudden an ad pops up. So anyway, so I type in an image search for Squirt because I wanted a picture of the turtle from Finding Nemo's shell. <laughs> That is not what nope. came up with that search criteria. That, that is not what comes up. And it was bad, and I am traumatized, and, traumatizing. and I'm still yep. recovering. It was bad. It was really bad. So the moral of the story is be careful with your internet search. You wanted black concrete too, didn't you? Yep. You already have a bunch, though, don't and you? And red. Um, so the black box is where the black things are, and the red box is where the red things are, and the light gray box is where the light gray things are. Oh, oops. Then I put them in the wrong box. I am very nearly done sorting. Um, there's not enough room in your, uh, gray box for the gray things. What else is gray? Here, I'll put them in the light gray oh, box. Oh, I need light gray. But we need light gray concrete. What do you need the light gray for? Isn't that light gray up there? Or is that gray No, gray? that's gray up there. Oh. Okay. I double checked. I triple checked okay. because I thought it was light gray as well, but no, it's not. It's gray. Okay, then we'll put the gray concrete and the light gray concrete all in the same box. Or no, we'll put the gray stained glass in the light gray box. That should work. Makes sense. Since Arcadius is sick and doesn't have a voice to complain, I'm going to go see if he's got ink sacks over at his. Awesome. I would just like to go on the record for once that I am not the one pillaging from him. Oh, it's for you, so that's close enough, right? Shh, shh, shh. <laughs> By the way, how are you down three and a half hearts? What happened? Oh, I was flying, and then there was a wall. No, oh, eat something. You shouldn't be down three and a half hearts. A little glitch. As in real life, I forget about eating things. <laughs> yeah, as in real life, that's a problem. Oh, I forgot. The incomprehensible symbology. They're happy. I have more. So what? 
the labels that Paul has on his storage. <laughs> yeah, see, that's why we have one box for everything. Uh, I'm okay with more than one box for a thing, just so long as the labels make sense. Okay, well, like, I will have all the colored wool in a box together. Like, I'm not going to do, like, a box for yellow wool. There will be a box for wool, but... See, that is one of the things like, that we never did actually nail down is uh, in our storage system. Are we going to have, like, a box for all the yellow things or a box for all the woolen things? And that kind of stuff. Um, we never had that discussion. Nope, we didn't. I don't know the answer. That's why I was bringing it up. Do you have opinions on that? Oh, because I was going to say, I, I have plenty of opinions. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, I said what I meant. <laughs> uh... That's not an opinion, that's an expression. It's an expressive opinion. Mm -mm. Uh, that's not how they work. I just did a server reboot. I should not be glitching like that. to accelerate the uh, look for a server. That was, uh, that was something right. special. There, officially organized. Hello, fishy. You know, the nice thing about using a flaming sword is your meat comes pre-cooked. Funny. Run low on uh, cooked salmon. I just hit him with the flaming sword and I get cooked salmon. Any other day, there's like 50 squid floating around here. But the day that I really could use... Hello. Yeah, there's a part of me that almost wanted to go fill in this river or do something else with it, but it's been a wonderful source of squid. Like this Which guy. River? My river? Yeah. Oh, that's my river. I've also thought about trying to find a place that we could set up a decent ink farm on, too. I could use one of those. Yeah, it was your kind of projects that made me think of the idea. for me to see if anyone in chat is saying anything. Is that a thing? Um, yeah, it is. Uh, the question is how to do it without absolutely killing bandwidth. Um, I don't know what to do. Because you could load up the stream and have the in-stream chat going. But, uh, that would be me streaming out to come back down the pipe. But that's okay, since there's nobody watching. There's nobody chatting. All right, I have all our stuff organized and it's in my box, which is in my box. Okay, I got about 32 black ink. I really wasn't planning on killing all the salmon, but I think they are the reason why I don't have that many squid. Because there are too many salmon? Yeah. There's a mob a cap for yeah. There's a mob cap for the number of uh, 
things they can spawn in water. A little fishy. One fish, two fish. Redfish lawsuit. This one has a little car. This one has a cease and desist. Although, I don't know. Um, what about the mouse? Those, uh... There was a guy who did a parody of, oh, the places you will go. And it was a mashup of Dr. Seuss and Star Trek. And it was absolutely wonderful. And the Dr. Seuss estate naturally sued over the mashup. And the guy actually won the case in court. So he was oh, allowed wow. to do the parody. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Hold on one second. One locomotive. Two locomotive. Are you sleeping in the game? I keep forgetting that the single player sleep doesn't, uh, it cycles rapidly, but not instantly. I slept so you didn't die. You're welcome. Oh, it's getting your ink, so you, you, this, that was more enlightened self-interest than, uh. Shh, I was being helpful. I'm still, even though we've been playing with this one for a while, I, I still think of the one that we had on the last server where it kind of instantly popped it up a day instead of moving in stages. kind of like that one. I liked the end result, but I do not like that it was this weird hacky thing with command blocks that really killed all the server logs. Trying to find useful information in the server logs was, um... Eh, we'll call it something special. Die, squid! Ah. Are you fishing now, too? Yep. I finished organizing. You finished organizing? Hang on, let me clip that for later. Well, I finished... Oh, shush. No, oh, no, no. You said it. You said it on air, too. And it's on the internet. It, it, everything on the internet like lasts game. forever. I don't like this game anymore. You don't like this game anymore? Mm -mm. No? Not even a little bit? Uh -uh. Not the recording game. That's not fun. <laughs> I mean, this is the internet. The place where things get recorded and taken out of context and used against you at the least opportune moment. Like that quote right there will almost certainly, now that it's been recorded, be taken out of context and used against me at the least opportune moment. Oh, yep. Killing the salmon definitely makes the squid come alive. Yep. Yeah, there's a uh, mob cap about how many things will spawn in the water. It is also influenced by the number of players online. What the specific math is and how it's influenced, I could not say. I'm not quite that adept at that technical side. Um, how do I make more squid and less fishies show up? Roll the dice. Because that's pretty much how that works. I mean, with some of the farm designs, there are ways to increase the odds of a squid forming. And if you do the stuff like the guys on the Cycraft server, you can actually 
Yeah, they, wow. I watched that video where Mumbo did a tour on the Psycraft server, and those guys are something very, very special. In a good way. Psycraft, like PsyOps? Uh, no. Psycraft is in ScienceCraft. Like, oh, they, okay. under, they understand how to influence the RNG code from within the game. Oh. So they have, like, an RNG reset. So they know that when you break a mine ore block, it will always give you the maximum yield for a Fortune 3 pickaxe. Wow. They figured That's out how to create a machine that even they think is too OP for use. And it, oh my. yes, yeah, it, it is very oh my. Um, it, it is one of those things that you, you just have to, you have to see it. I could try to explain it to you, and no, you'll you'll have to see it. Okay, so I killed all the salmon, and now I have like seven squid. It's awesome. Nice. How much ink do you think we need? I don't know. I was about to ask that because I've already got a stack and another 20. But we need... Huh? Oh, Finish it is a looting sword. How much, uh, how much black concrete do you think you need? Much. A ballpark. I don't have a guesstimate. I've just been doing it. Okay, um, so you, you, you don't know how many you put down in that other floor. I can find out. Hold on. Are you up or down? Whee! I like that. The resources up in the middle. Did you move the project boxes back up to the top? Yep, they're upstairs now. Okay. one's got your uh, sand and gravel. Not down yet. But they're not all facing the same way. Hold on a second. <laughs> you know, I'm going to come through and start randomly placing which way they are, right? Don't you dare. That's not even funny. Oh, Roy is making an appearance. Oop. Roy B. Red, orange, yellow. Oh, <laughs> Always. Why would I not? So this is one, two, three. There we go. Four, okay. Five, so the six. gravel is in the brown box. Because, duh. The important completed things like my bookshelf and my enchanting table and a couple of random things of terracotta, my obsidian, my chiseled sandstone, and my chiseled stone bricks are in this uncolored sugar box. The black things go in the black box. Okay. The 
gray concrete and gray carpet goes in the gray box. The gray stained glass and light gray concrete goes in the light gray box. The white things go in the white box. Are you seeing a pattern? Mm -hmm. Nothing is ever going to go in my pink boxes because I hate the color pink. Um, you know what you're missing up here? This blue box. A what? crafting table. That's a really valid point. I'll be right back. <laughs> Wait, you don't have any lumber in any of these boxes? No. Hang on. I've probably got one in my backpack. Yeah, but I have like four crafting tables. It's like downstairs. Yeah, I've got a whole bunch floating around too. Don't ask me where all of them are. But I've got them. It's kind of like guitar tuners that way. I know I have five guitar tuners. I can find Where two of them. Uh, one of them's in the desk holding up my guitar amps. You think? No, no, no. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Yeah, no, no, no. Two of them. Two, two of them are in the desk. Holding up the guitar amps. You know, it's not very positive about this. I'm positive enough that I'm almost willing to go run around and check, but not 100% sure. Okay. Because I can't remember if I put one of them in one of the guitar cases or not. Hmm. I have Sam Minute can go in my pink box. Sure. We'll go with that. Sam is pink. you haven't started uh, renaming your shulker boxes. Wait, you can name them? Yeah, you can name them on an anvil. And that's what shows up in the top left corner when you open it up. See? If you open up the black shulker box I just set down, it'll say backpack. <gasps> I would like to do this thing. <laughs> 1 XP for rename. One, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'll be right back. We need more squid. <laughs> uh, hey, I've got three, five, six, seven, eight stacks of concrete powder, and I'm about to make some more. That is, there we go. Uh, is that going to be enough? That might be enough. Oh, no, not yellow. Orange. Yellow is where the lighting stuff goes. Because that's the color light is. Yeah, well, based on your theme, I figured yellow would also be where the sand was, because that is the color of the sand. I don't know where you've been going to the beach, but that's not supposed to be the color of sand. I know that's not supposed to be, but it looks like a light <laughs> yellow, at least via the Mojang texture pack. Oh, and, uh... 1.14 has hit pre-release. They're doing a lot of the tidying up and all that. And, uh... Yeah, we shall... We we might be seeing it fairly soon. I wouldn't expect it, like, How tomorrow, but... Soon. I'm... I would hazard a guess that we're probably still a couple of months out. Because it sounds like there's still a fair number of bugs to work out. To, like by Arcadius's birthday or uh no no sooner than that probably by I would guess some somewhere around the summertime but that's more an educated guess of looking at the list of bugs to fix and how long it's taking them to fix other stuff yeah it's a semi-educated guess all right while you're doing that I'm gonna start turning 
What are you turning? Oh, yeah, turning all the terracotta. Mm-hmm. <laughs> all the terracotta. Hey, at least we have the wrench. That, that is one of the things that we added, one of the uh, data packs that we have on the server is a terracotta rotation wrench. Which is an absolute godsend. You can use the wrench to rotate glazed terracotta and redstone components. And it is just phenomenal. I love it. I absolutely love it. But there's so much stuff. Especially when I was trying to get the uh, observers in place for a, a recent project. Is you got to put them in backwards to get them to fire the way you want. And I really didn't feel like clearing out half the project area just so I could get behind the project to put the observer in. I, I kind of like that. I can just plop him down and hit him with a wrench until he faces right. Yeah, but the problem is I didn't realize until turning the terracotta that um, not all the block ends line up. Right. What do you mean? Is this with I'll your actual you like game layout, or or with your um? No, like on the side. So like, if the face is correct, like if you're looking at a cube, if dice side one is correct, then you turn it to the right, and the next two sides don't line up. Oh. Huh. Interesting. It's super annoying. Come on, I'm holding down both. Bloody oath. There we go. I just gotta figure out how to light underneath my temple. Because it's kind of dark and things keep spawning. Are you talking about um, the ground or do you want lighting as in so you can take a look at the underside of the temple? I mean, I don't think we really need to look at the underside of the temple. I'm just thinking like, it'd be really nice if when I was trying to run to bed, I didn't die. Yeah, I hear that is kind of nice. Uh, do you want to do more sunken sea lanterns like what we have in the field around the around the farm? Or were you looking for something a little different? Something a little different. Because unless you're looking to make structures, your options are kind of limited. I need lanterns to be a thing. Uh, that will come with 1.14. Well, it needs to hurry up. Yeah, that's what a lot of people have been saying. Hmm. Hmm? I mean, I am next to the I villager farm, so all I have in my ear is... Hmm. Hmm. That joker's lucky I haven't figured it. I haven't gotten around to turning him into a potato farm yet. Which joker? The one on the villager farm. I mean, we haven't been producing much in the way of villagers because we have nowhere to put them at the moment. We need to trade some of them out. Some of them are useless. Uh, some of them are useless now. They just haven't been fully unlocked. Okay, so some of them we don't know are useless yet because they haven't been fully unlocked. Why do you think I've been AFK the last three days trying to get potatoes and carrots and whatnot for emeralds and thing? Okay, something is not lining up with my terracotta at all. You having terracotta troubles? In between, yes, in between room A and room B, there is something wrong. Are you actually going to put that as a sign, room A, room B? I mean... I wasn't, but now that might be a thing. <laughs> I 
Ooh, what if I made one pillar black and one pillar red and one pillar the amount of stuff? That could work. And then we could note the pillars by their colors. Or denote the rooms by their colors. Yep. That would be cool. So you can have the green room and the yellow room. I would never have a green room or a yellow room. You can have a black room and a gray room and a red room. So a black room, a blacker room. Uh huh. And what? I'm totally naming one of them that now. The blackest room. How much more black can it be? None. None more. Yeah, you know, we haven't oh, watched that movie no. in a while, and I love Spinal Tap, but uh, has Arcadius ever seen Spinal Tap? I don't think so. A little bit sad. But I bet after working where you have for as long as you have more and more of the jokes and references uh, take on a whole new meaning, huh? They do, except the I make the jokes and people don't get them. And that makes me sad. Okay, yeah, bit. but half your staff is too young to go drinking with. You are not wrong. <laughs> and that movie came out in... 80... what? Yeah, they make really sweet comments. Yeah. They think we're similarly aged. <laughs> Which is a wonderful kind of special all unto itself. Hey, yes, it by is. the by... While you're up there, you wouldn't happen to be sleeping, would you? Um, I didn't bring a bed up here, but I can go get one. You don't have a spare bed? No. Really? I usually... you sleep. <laughs> of course. Of course. But I gotta move it up here anyway, because eventually I'm not gonna have the downstairs thing. Oh, you're not... that's gonna go away? Mm-hmm. Oh, cool. All right, um... Come on, yeah, server, cooperate! It was just cooperate. my starter base. Eventually, I'll be completely upstairs. Up, oh, over... no, 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 no! Lag boost! Eventually, I will be exclusively in the demon tower. It's just very Ohio State. Oh no, I was going for demonic. Well, if you know. If that happens to coincide, that's not my issue. If you're Michigan, then those two are the same. <laughs> that's what we should do. What? Change the color of everything at Arcadia's base to Michigan colors. Are we going to put a big M on there as well? Heck, yes. Let me go pull up the uh, diagram for a chicken. We'll make the Michigan awesome. chicken. What is the Michigan mascot? Like the real one. Um... What'd you say, Arcadius? A loser? Okay, Google. <laughs> what is Michigan's mascot? What is Michigan's mascot? It's a live Wolverine who served as a team mascot at University of Michigan in the 1920s and 1930s. Biff. It's a Wolverine named Biff. Named Biff? Biff. 
like Marty McFly versus Biff? Yeah, actually. Huh. Yeah, I wasn't expecting it either. Of course, it also occurs to me that that is another reference that, uh... It's best not to dwell on whether or not... Oh, none of them would get it! Sad. That... Yeah, yeah. That's more sad than I care to admit. Shovel's not going to help. There we go. We? I went up the ladder. The thingy, bubble, elevator, whatever oh. you call it. We could do a slime block launcher. Mm -mm. I think given all of Arcadius's big dig projects, we've accumulated enough slime to make a few. And then some. We could probably make a slime out of the slime. Like a giant slime statue. Ew. Why would that be a thing? Because. Why are many things a thing? Because. Gosh darn it. What? I'm making your concrete. No. <laughs> the oopsies. The oopsies? Yes. Things are not lining up. Not bad. Hey, uh, Arcadius. While you're up, could I get some water, please? Crap. Okay. I figured out the problem. Ow. So for them to line up on one side, they don't line up on the other because of the weird rotation issue. Okay. So see here, this room is correct. Okay. With the dark circles at this level. And then okay. they stay on the match up on the sides here. Go on the other side of this pillar. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, okay, so... No, I, I don't... I don't see the problem. The dark circles are lower. Because look at the side. So can... this is... This square, bottom left corner, has the dark circle, right? The dark circles in the four corners. On this <laughs> bottom piece. Okay. If you go to the other side of the same thing, it's two side circles instead of okay. the four corners. I was looking at the bigger pattern. I was looking at the bigger pattern, and the bigger pattern looked right. I don't know what to do unless I just alternate in every room. <laughs> you, you really want to tell really her to make the walls? To this thing down again? No. I already tore it down and changed its orientation 90 degrees. Yes, anybody who listens to this later, you heard that right. This structure was already fully built one. And then I decided that it would look better because originally <laughs> went the length of the river. And then I decided I didn't like it and the towers had weird stairs that connected it. And I realized if it went the opposite direction, then I would be able to feed the towers directly into the rooms. 
So I tore it all down and built it again. Again. Oh, oh, fly! Fly, you fool. Yeah, I, I do have the sudden urge to watch that again. I've been reading the books. The Lord of the Rings. You know Rayast is going to give you dirty looks for not catching that one. We don't know him. I found the uh, Amazon listing for the old Rankin Bass animated Hobbit. There are comments going. The instrumentation feels a little bit dated, but it's still better than the Peter Jackson one. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> to be fair, they're not wrong. Well, I, said, I sent you that, uh, that message. I can't remember if it was DTNS or Chord Killers, but one of the guests was talking to Tom, and <laughs> he, he said some, something along the lines of uh, he was watch, watching the Lord of the Rings again. And that it held up really well. And he appreciates it even more now that we have the Hobbit. Now that we can see... Yes, yeah, I did now, that. now that we can see how badly you can mess up the original material. And it was badly messed up. It was. I mean, even the Lord of the Rings stepped on a few things here and there. But it wasn't egregiously bad. They stepped on a few things, but... Most of them I was able to go, okay, m like book to movie, it's never going to be a perfect translation. I am willing to accept these variances. Yeah. Except I still feel like the world has been robbed of, of the opportunity to have Tom Bombadil, played by Richard Simmons. Yes, played by Richard Simmons. That, that, that would have been something. Thing. Okay. Uh, I've put together a whole bunch of black concrete for you for the next floor. Um, I'm unwilling at this hour to try to math it out. Okay. But I'm pretty sure you could get well along the way. Do you want That's the floor for the next le do you want the floor for the next level at the level of these gray beams or one level above that? I don't know. You don't know? No, I don't know. Um again, this is not like one of those like super planned out, mathed out, laid out things. This is more of a Brian esque I have a picture in my head that's written in paint. Okay. Okay. Which is also now a word. Brian esque Brian esque. Mm hmm. Although, if you want the wrench, you can start turning. I have a couple of wrenches somewhere. I might be sitting next to the guitar tuners. Oh, psh, please. <laughs> All right. Uh, doo -doo. I figured out the pillar that made it wrong. I mean, I'm still gonna have to invert the rooms, but... 
as li- looks like. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Seriously, you're, you're gonna run around and no, no, I'm out. I'm go- I'm I'm off to the angry fish farm to repair my pickaxe. What? <laughs> what? You're serious. <laughs> what? So one pillar is off, and now you're gonna have to re-rotate the whole thing. Yeah. Okay. I'm confused at why you're surprised. I never said I was surprised. But I mean, not all of it was done yet. I only had half the rooms done. But I kind of feel like I can't go finish the other rooms without this. Although, if you want, you can keep finding me one of every block. Uh, yeah. Why do I feel like I just got told that was a negative ghost rider? Because that's a negative like, ghost rider. I haven't turned yet. This is the one. No. This way, right? Yeah. So they should alternate. So the pillar you're on should match this pillar here. Nope, you want the black circle in the middle. Huh? So. So the middle of these four at that level should all be the same. So see how it's a black circle in the middle here or a black, I don't know, butterfly looking thing? And then this one, the middle of these four, is a black circle. Great circle. Uh, has, has this become the uh, Minecraft Rorschach test? Totally. I, I, I see a butterfly flying on the... No. <laughs> it's not a butterfly to you? It's totally a butterfly. I mean, it looks like a set piece out of Doctor Strange. It could be. You act like that's not a possible... Uh, it's the corners that I'm not sure how you were trying to work those. How do you mean... Sort of that out. Here, got it. I don't know what you just did. I moved the shulker box out of the way so I get to the bottom of the corner. Like that. Like that. Put all the way. Up. Yep. Okay. Did that make sense? Yeah. Surprisingly, it did. I'm a little worried. <laughs> you should be.
to be fair, as boring as turning terracotta is, this is so all the way better than having to place it a hundred million times over. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I, I've mentioned a few times that I absolutely love this data pack. Who made this? Uh, one of... I know it came off of Azuma Void's website, and one of the people over in his community put this together along with a few others. Oh. Is he one of the scary server admins? Azuma? Yes. Uh. Yeah. That can make the Minecraft universe move at his whim. Yeah. You can have all sorts of fun with command blocks. No, you can all have all sorts of fun with command blocks. I can turn terracotta. Just realized. And then what? the capstone of my Minecraft achievement. What did you just realize? Uh, what time it was. What time is it? About quarter after nine. Oh. Is it time for you to turn into a princess? If I want to be up for work at four in the morning. That's fair. I hear showing up for work is how you get paid. Generally speaking, I believe that is how jobs work, yes. I mean, I could be mistaken. From what I read on Twitter. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, just, you know, see my first few days with any new employee. Yeah. It's cute when they think you're playing. It really is. Well, for those watching, it is. You know what's even cuter? What? When they think my friend who just got moved out here is. <laughs> that will be interesting. And then when they realize that I'm the nice one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright. Soon as it turns daylight, I'm going to 